to ride through the bush like where's 22 I don't got a cap, put that on my hat I was in the trench, nigga, where was you? Yeah, nigga, rap, but I told strap They tryna get close, what I'm supposed to do? Be tight my killers don't catch you And I'm cool if they hit somebody close to you Let's get it she got her ass, she gon' shake it Since Holly Rome kicked a hole in the game Before multiple views by Tommy gone Gotta be strong when you're popping the paparazzi form Slider singing in your local precinct like you already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang. If you like what's going on here, subscribe to the channel. Shout out to my bro, Showtime SP. Shout out to my dog, Scrap. All my network partners over at Fox 5. And share the video, man. Share the video. You share, you niggas share blunt. Y'all share bitches. Yes, sir. This nigga's Y'all <laughs> share clothes, y'all niggas be sharing sneakers, share the video, you know what I'm saying? Share like y'all share them hoes. Shout out to everybody y'all out there. Um, I got a couple things I want to break down today. Uh, I seen, you know what I'm saying? I've been seeing and I've been hearing. URL's coming out with a card, I'll get to that. I'm a, I ain't gonna hold you, it's an app card. I'm not really that excited, I'm not really that excited. I spoke to Showtime SP about it. He was like, all right, cool. He came over here, did the sports podcast, and went on about his way. He wasn't excited about it either. Uh, it looks like it's a redemption. You know what I'm saying? You're all throwing a redemption card. And then I'll get to uh, what Calico said to Swamp and how Calico's basically calling Swamp out, you know what I'm saying, in the, in, towards the end of this, right? But what's up with y'all, man? How's everything been going? Uh, you know, obviously NFL playoffs are still going on. That shit's still happening and things like that. And uh, what's been popping with y'all week. But let's get to it, man. So you all got a card with uh, T-Top versus Snake Eyes, JC versus J2, O-Red versus Kid Chaos, Shotgun Shook versus Kitchen Clean, and Chef Trez versus Fonz. Um, Redemption 3. You are all Redemption 3, Redemption 2, Redemption 3. App, 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 nigga. It's going on app. Uh, <sighs> looks like a, you know, kind of like a middle of the pack card. Uh... Chef Trez versus Fonz, that should be a pretty good matchup. This is this this is this is dope. You know what I'm saying? This is dope. You know what I mean? I, and, I, and I would watch that. I think I would break that down too. Fire battle. Um going into a Chef Trez versus Fonz, I'd have to see it. Both cause it's I kinda like I'm like on some two one either way type shit, but I'd have to see it in order to make it happen. Shotgun Shook versus Kitchen Clean. I got shotgun Shook 3 0. Uh clean then clean just like no show on, on online if <laughs> really what we talking about, this is whole shit, man. No matter what you are do, no matter how they throw, try to throw this nigga in our face, we still know. You know what I'm saying? Like, it is what it is. I don't go back and forth with Clean. I don't got no issue with him. If you ever have an issue, it's about me talking about him no showing battles or taking niggas' deposits and not showing up. That, you know what I'm saying? And I don't care. Like, if a, if a battle rapper or artist has an issue with me calling out an issue or talking about some shit that they didn't do in a battle, I really don't give a fuck. It just be what it be. Actually, a league gonna hit me up. A league gonna hit me up. It was like, yo, should I book said name? A nigga who just literally like didn't show up and do I was like, hell no. You know what I'm saying? Do not book that nigga and you could tell him that I said don't do it. <laughs> because I don't care. If a league gonna call me about an artist who got some shit going on and no show, I'm be like, don't book him. I don't care. Especially if they want me involved. You wanna get me involved, be on the car, who's the car, do some shit, and then you booking a nigga who don't show up or some nah, no, 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 no. So uh, shotgun Shug, I got Shotgun Shug winning 2-1 if not 3-0. Clean is cool, but even in his performances and all of that shit back on URL, it ain't really been like that. I don't even know if he won any battles. I do not know if this nigga has won a single battle since he's been back on URL. Come on, my nigga. <laughs> Y'all let me know. You know, the 2-on-2 two -two with Mac Myron and all of that, you know what I'm saying? That's that, that They won that battle versus 2-on-2 two -two with him and Mac Myron versus Rock and Swervo, but 2-on-2 two -two is just like all-star game shit. It is what it is, you know what I'm saying? But in the shotgun shoot versus clean battle, I got shotgun shoot winning. And a lot too. Uh Kid Chaos versus O Red. Is this a one rounder? Is Kid Chaos versus O Red a one rounder? O Red ain't showed y'all shit about him being able to make it through no goddamn three round. You are what type of The nerve of you. <laughs> but you That's know, like disrespect. It. That's you are <laughs> What do these niggas have going on? This nigga has not shown us he can get through three rounds in three years. I got Kid Chaos winning this battle 2-1, if not 3-0. Uh, if O-Red makes it through a round, that could be a debate of 1-1, but if I'm doing over and under, I'll go under two. I don't think he gonna get over two. I don't think this nigga is getting out of two rounds. Yeah, that's how we are, that's 2024. We don't get niggas more. And like, nah, I'm not even hating or nothing. I just do not think O-Red is gonna make it out of three rounds in 2024. I don't, I, there's no way. And you all got the little shits up here with the poles on it. 
Uh, you know what I'm saying? So you could probably you can go on their Instagram, or you can vote on the battles or whatever the case may be. But Kid Chaos, in a perfect world, O Red has rapped better enough in time to get with anybody. I've seen him battle so many people before and battle at a high level. But in 2022, 2023, probably 2021 too, this nigga ain't getting through no rounds. He need T, he need Eucalyptus, he need Ricola. That nigga. Oh, hell no! He need Ricola. That nigga need everything. He don't get through no rounds. He is not making it through three rounds of material. I got Kid Chaos on the over. I got Kid Chaos with three rounds. I got Old Red with one and a half, maybe two. Um. JC versus J. Y'all like you are what the fuck? <laughs> Yo, what the what do these niggas have going on, son? And this is an app only event. Is this an app only event? Because this guy the only place you niggas could be pushing this shit is the app. What kind of shit is here? <laughs> and I hope it comes out too. Drop all of these joints because I'm gonna be honest with you. App, app. Y'all been shaky with my eight the past couple months. I've stuck with it for the $7.99, $8 a month, but I'm really thinking about taking that $8 a month and going to Jersey Mike's because there ain't really shit that I can recap. They, I don't even remember the last time I did the app recap. And I've done more app recaps than probably anybody, especially on my level. Niggas don't even look at that shit. They don't even give a fuck. The app don't generate no interest. I'm be honest with you. I be out here every fucking day. App don't generate no interest. Nobody ain't worrying about that shit. I recap them. You niggas who put them out don't, so you don't know. Nobody cares. Now, JC versus J2. I'm going to give J2 some props because I saw J2 in a battle with Mac Myron where he, he drugged Mac Myron ass across the street. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? By his sneakers. You know what I'm saying? He went crazy on Mac Myron. JC, J2 been fired. You know what I'm saying? J2, he gets busy for, you know what I'm saying? He has a lot of bars. And he beat Mac Myron. Go watch J2 versus Mac Myron. You know what I'm saying? He beat him all damn near 30 ball. You know what I'm saying? Mac Myron's another nigga who went to URL. I'll talk about the Chris and Bias stock drop list in a second, too. You know what I'm saying? He was talking about Mac Myron and some other niggas on there, too. And I definitely agree with some things. Um, so, JC versus J2. If JC cares, you know what I'm saying? Like, how is it going to be? JC's a tough MC to beat. J2 is good too, and it's good to see J2 get in a match. I know people, you know what I'm saying, gonna get on bash him about his sexuality and all of that. I'm not really, you know what I'm saying, that doesn't really, it's not a determining factor when I'm watching battles, you know what I'm saying? If somebody's nice, they nice, it is what it is. Uh, I got JC winning this 2 1. I go 2 1 JC. Um, T Top versus Snake Eyes. I really don't even care about this battle. Snake Eyes is not even good. Y'all been dragging this nigga around for years and years and years. He's not good. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He don't win no fucking battles. Get washed. They did them just like that, you hear that? That's the lawnmower. We still cutting the grass out here with these snake ass niggas. We still cutting the grass. You know what I'm saying? That's what you hearing. But yeah, he got chopped all the way up. And you got him against T-Top. But T-Top ain't been winning no fucking battles either. So, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. This is probably redemption for a lot of these niggas. They need redemption. Yeah, you, you know what, you are As I explained and broke down every single premise of the battles that I see, I understand why it is. Sometimes you have to speak things through, you know what I'm saying? You gotta speak it through, you know what I'm saying? This ain't hating, this just is what it is. Snake Eyes is not good, the nigga's damn near, he is trash actually, the nigga ain't even good. He's not even good. Who does he beat? He don't beat nobody. And they'll jump on camera, oh, I beat this person, nigga. I watched him versus Av, he lost. I watched him versus Coffee Brown, he lost. I watched him versus Stumbles, he lost. I watched him versus Twerk, he lost. Nigga, I done watched like four or five battles from this nigga. This nigga don't win no fucking battles. So y'all gonna drag him back out there and he gonna lose to T-Top. I got T-Top winning 2-1 if not 3-0, if he even cares. Because T-Top was choking and stumbling in his last shit too versus Prep. So I, matter of fact, I got this battle 0-0. These niggas don't care. And on a scale of 1 to 10, I only rate this card maybe... Mm, Five, I guess it ain't really that good. It's okay. It's not really that good, and I'm not hating. You know what I'm saying? It's just these battles are just okay. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, Fonz versus Trez, fire. Suge versus Clean, I didn't even know this nigga gonna be there. O Red versus Kid Chaos, O Red gonna have two rounds. JC versus J2, that's a decent battle. And Snake Eyes versus T Top, Snake Eyes is trash. Now moving on, um, and that's just my personal opinion. I don't think the nigga's good. He been on URL since 2015, 16, on and off. The nigga's not good. He don't win battles. Period. Every battle that I see, the nigga lose. You know what I'm saying? He lost Kobe Brown, damn near 3 0. Not good. Y'all can force him on us, but the nigga ain't good. Now, moving on. Uh, 
Calico, another name that could have possibly been on here. Maybe like a Calico versus Swamp. But Calico and Swamp ain't on this card because I just saw the reason why I even made this blog to begin with. Now, Swamp, I do appreciate what you do. I like you as an MC. I think you're pretty talented. I think you've had some moments. I think you've had your highs. I think you've had your lows. Do I think that uh, MCs are quote unquote ducking you? Absolutely not. I don't really feel that way. And this is my personal opinion. I don't feel like niggas be ducking niggas when they've already battled and beat or battled and had bigger and better names. You know what I'm saying? Not saying that Swamp is a, he's a good name. But he's already battled easy. He's already battled goods. He's already battled verb. He's already battled rock. He's already battled all these niggas. He's not ducking Swamp. I'm sorry. He, he, he is Swamp. I don't know who's calling you or who's sending you these messages, my nigga, but I, I can't believe that you're being ducked. I'm sorry. I, and this is just 2024. This is my energy. I'm sorry. I, I got to call it. I call it. So I can't spoil it. So, uh, Swamp had replied to a tweet saying he's scared. You know what I'm saying? Because they were saying, yo, why the battle ain't happening? Boo, boo, boo. Swamp said he's scared. Calico said his league don't believe in him. He, and Calico has lamented this before, that your league don't believe in you, right? And they got the money because if they want, they, they book niggas all the time. They gave fucking Cassidy 100000 and not battle. Freeway money did not battle, so they got the money, right? So he says, nah. They just ain't never paid you what you asking for. Cut the crap. So what basically what Swamp is alluding to is that URL has never paid Calico what he's asking for to battle him. That's what he said, right? So Calico says, I've never negotiated anything for you. I've never been called or had any conversation about you on my mama. Now, one thing I do know about Calico, I will say this. Calico is a troll, but one thing I will say about Calico, Calico is very smart, he's very calculated, he doesn't make bad moves, and he takes battles that are gonna help him financially and build his profile and things like that. He not gonna tweet that I've never negotiated anything for you, I've never been called and had conversations about you on my mama if he did. That's all I'm gonna say. If he had negotiations, a number, a price, or some shit about you, he would have said it. All that's telling me is niggas is giving Swamp the run around. Like, they've been giving you the run around ever since you backed off the fucking Midnight Man this car. You've been getting the run around, my nigga. And this is what people are saying. And I'm going to read you the card. It says, the legit same thing he said verbatim. Like, verbatim. Because you said Verb was ducking you, too. Then another reply says, this nigga going to use the ducking angle on all the big names because he can't get the names he wants. Someone else says, I was just thinking the same thing. Nasty work. This is the very same thing he did with Verb. I don't know what y'all seeing, Swamp. Why would Calico be afraid of Swamp? Bro, like, you gotta see what the replies are. Niggas is not even jacking that he's afraid of you. In the beginning, because it works with one MC, you know what I'm saying? When you do one MC, Verb had a choice to battle you, had a choice to battle Ward. He took Ward, a uh, different platform, bigger card, make the same money, and he don't have to deal with the hecklers or the bullshit in the URL crowd. You know, URL crowd be biased and shit like that. You know, yeah, Verb coming there, he not a pro URL nigga, they not gonna be on his side. So he took the other MC, A Ward, had one of the, the bigger grudge matches of the whole summer, was on a big, was on a huge card, promoted well, you know what I'm saying? Max out went great, and here we are. 